Hello and welcome to this very short video uh, on how to leverage machine learning in uh, Cloud Pack for Business Automation, more specifically Automation Decision Services, also known as ADS. What we're going to do today is that we are going to take a part of a sample that comes with ADS. It's a Jupyter Notebook. We're going to load this notebook into Watson Studio. We are going to configure it to correctly point to our Watson ML instance. And then we're going to run it to generate a PMML deployment file and upload that into Watson Machine Learning, which we later on can then use to make predictions in ADS. So to get started, we are going to go into our projects in Watson Studio. We're going to create a new empty project and we're going to give it a name. The next thing we're going to do is that we are going to um, we want to upload the Jupyter Notebook from our ADS sample. So we are going to create a new asset. We're going to asset tab and create a new asset in Watson Studio. And this will be of the type Jupyter Notebook. We're going to do it from a file and we're going to upload the notebook from the ADS sample. This notebook does a sequence of things. It loads data, uh, explores it, it uh, uses scikit-learn to train a machine learning model, and finally it saves this machine learning model as a PMML file. And then it uploads it into what's a machine learning. And to do this upload, we need to configure the notebook to point to our instance of what's on machine learning. That includes the URL, an API key, and the third thing uh, it needs is a pointer to the specific deployment space in Watson Machine Learning where we want our PMML model to be stored. So with these three items, we can then run uh, our notebook. And as you'll see, it automatically gets the data, trains the model, creates the PMML and uploads it into What's some machine learning? And now we can go into our deployment space and verify that the model is correctly uh, stored there. You can see deployments and you can see our newly created payment default deployment of the type PMML. And that's it for this short tutorial. Once this PMML model is stored in What's the machine learning in the deployment space? We can, of course, pick it up as normal from ADS to create and configure predictive models and to make predictions inside decisions. Thank you very much for listening and until next time. Bye bye.